Today on Kia Kid News. A missing McCall with a big reward. A missing pet from Northland has set off a nationwide bird hunt. I'll be helping out search for Pablo. Kia ora, this is Willow recording for Kia Kids News. Today I'm in Howick to search for Pablo the car. But why did Pablo fly away? And how are kids like me helping? Pablo's favourite food is chunky dog roll, figs, apples and walnuts. We are at Melons Bay School with Pablo's owner Lulu to see some of the drawings the kids have done of Pablo. When I was feeling really sad, I got loads of lovely drawings of Pablo from this school and from all other schools around New Zealand. It's gorgeous. What's your favourite thing about Pablo? Maybe like the green part on his head and his colourful feathers. He's got a huge beak. Tell me about your Pablo picture. Well, um, me and my buddy, we thought that we'd put like all of the background stuff in and then the bird and then like we'd find like different places to put all of the facts in. What sort of facts do you have on your poster? I that he lives in American rainforest. He lives up to 50 years. Where they came from, the scientific name, what they eat, their predators. When did you decide to teach the kids about him? Oh, well, lots of my class came back from the holidays. They were asking me if I had heard about a missing macaw called Pablo, and we decided to have a little look into it. Here is what we know about Pablo. He either flew or was taken away from his home. What was your first reaction when he was missing? Panic. Absolute panic. Tears. Help. What do I do? On 5th of February, he was sighted in East Auckland. A huge bird hunt was launched with Lulu coming down from Russell. Pablo has flown over 250 kilometers from Russell to Howard. He's been missing for weeks and the reward for finding him is up to $7,000. Many people in East Auckland community have been looking for Pablo and were phoning Lulu with sightings. How has the Facebook page helped? Every time we saw Pablo, I was able to put on there where he was. So all the children and all the adults went outside and were able to keep their eyes and ears open and let me know in which direction he was flying. On Wednesday, 15 February, about 6.30 p.m., a man in shorts and a singlet top was seen walking past Dockery Hill with a blue and gold macaw on his arm. He was spotted by a local vet nurse who tried to follow and take picture. Sadly, Pablo has not been seen or heard from since. So it's really important that any kids that hear about anyone with a new macaw parrot, that they maybe let their mum and dad know. <laughs> How can a kid like me help? Well, I guess you can talk to all your friends about it. Tell them to keep their ears and eyes open. As long as everybody is remembering Pablo, then hopefully we'll find him. Pablo come home. With the whole community looking, it's only a matter of time before Pablo shows up. <laughs> this has been Will <laughs> reporting for Kia Kids News. Whoa! Thanks to New Zealand on air.